Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Guys, exciting day. We got Mizuno Wave Exceed 6 in the limited 10th anniversary edition. Stay tuned. Hey guys, do you need help organizing your tennis life? Well, think go. We got the Axiom line here, the nine pack duffel, my favorite bag, the nine pack Axiom 2.0. They even make a 12 pack if you're going on tour and my favorite backpack of all time. I love that bag. So if you want to organize your tennis life, think go. All right, check that out. Commemorative box for 10th anniversary. Even says number 10 over there. Aww. Who made it? Mizuno. All right, check it out. So the six, the six edition, the six model of the Wave Exceed, but in the 10th anniversary edition. Limited black and gold. that for you so if you're used to the wave exceed 5 they didn't change a whole lot on the shoe from the sole aspect of it there is still a six month warranty sole warranty not an upper warranty so if you burn a hole through it you get a new shoe within six months what they did change was the upper so it's a solid piece 3d now yes three dimensional so it's going to be more of a solid finish for stability so it's not as floppy as the previous generation 5 will be it is still feeling super light so for all you players basically flying around the court wanting a stable yet fast shoe this is it all right so the energy return on the midsole is still there there's a slight slight arch on here not a big arch okay guys not a big arch uh, if you've worn previous generations you know exactly what i'm talking about but it is meant man, to be fast. It feels so light. Let me grab that scale. All right, so what do we got here? What do we got there? 12.7 ounces. And that is on a six month warranted shoe. Might be unheard of. What does that come out to in grams? Throw it back in here. Three, 359 grams. Yeah, that's correct. Um, wow, I'm super excited to try this on. Because uh, I've deemed the five the shoe of the year a couple years ago. And... Uh, it took them a little while to come out with the six because I think the five was still doing so well. So like I said, they didn't change much, but you know, proof is in the plane. All right. Um, one quick thing, check that out. Check this out. Okay. It's going to hold you in a little bit better. All right. See you on the court.
All right, so we just got off the court. Mizuno Wave Exceed 6, 10th year tennis versary. What do you think about this color? Um, it's very gold and flashy. <laughs> well, as things should be when you're celebrating 10 years. Yeah. Uh, but let's talk about the serious part and the good stuff. Yep. How'd it feel? Uh, it's good. I think it's quite comfortable. This is a performance shoe. So for those who are looking for um, that kind of really explosive response off the sole bed, this is a shoe I think Mizuno did a really good job with. Lighter, for sure. Um, you know, compared to the other um, kind of speed FFs that you might see from um, Asics. Asics, Asics, or Adidas, uh, what is another one? Adi Zeros. Adi Zeros too as well. This is a good shoe that can compete with them. Um, I think it's interesting that they do the tongue thing here as well. Boom. They've always done that, but I've they've improved it, like it a little they've bit. They've improved it a lot. Yep. And I really like that this heel part too is quite well cushioned. And normally before it wasn't as cushioned and this is something I really liked a lot more. With this new model, um, they really made it, uh, you know, went all out with this 10th uh, uh, anniversary model. And uh, and yeah. Yep. You don't have to get this 10th anniversary model. It is a limited edition. There are other colors. If for any reason you don't like black and gold. The first thing I noticed as soon as stepping on the court with this was cushion. There was a lot of cushion mm -hmm. up here. Mm -hmm. There was great heel support that also had cushion. Um, I wasn't going overboard like in the previous version. This actually held me in very, very well. Mm -hmm. The lacing system um, clamped down pretty well. Uh, I feel like they could have done a better job holding me in, yep. but it's not bad. No. It's not bad. I wanted this to be softer in this part because yep. it kind of held me up instead of clamping down. But... Um, yeah, no, great update to the shoe. I'm glad they did this. And guys, candidate shoe of the year. Whoa. <laughs> Coach Chris. Where can you find you? You can find me at CV10 Tennis. <laughs> I'm glad you're doing the show by yourself, Coach Chris. <laughs> guys, thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on Chris's show.